guys, it's Trish. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is part 2 of reacting to Dior Cruise 2023 collection. Part 2 is going to be handbags and ready to wear. I already uploaded part 1. Part 1 is handbags. So if you guys want to watch that video, I will link it down below. If you guys are new to my channel, subscribe and follow me on Instagram. Before I do start today's video, I want to mention that I have a Patreon. Patreon is a monthly subscription that you guys can cancel anytime you want. On there, I have a lot of different kind of tiers. But my main tier for this channel is see Dior Aholics. And on there, I share Dior beauty gift codes, early access to my IG photos, early access to my YouTube videos, information on the Dior beauty loyalty program, early access to what I already purchased. So if I buy something from Dior, I will share to my patrons what I purchased already before I make an unboxing video. And I also share Diptyque gift codes. If you guys want to join my Patreon, I will link it down below. I also have a Like to Know It. Like to Know It is an app where I will post a photo, say I'm wearing this Dior jacket. I will link everything that I mentioned in that photo and you, it will bring you guys to the website if you guys want to purchase the same thing as me. I also have a TikTok. TikTok, I post like unboxings, but I'm trying to post some more like OOTDs, um, shopping vlogs, free videos, just a lot of random stuff and like little fun clips. I'll link all my social media platforms down below. So let's just get started to today's video. So like I said, today's video, I'll be reacting and also showing you guys the new collection that will come out in November. It should come out in November or like the beginning of November sometime. And this is great because this is usually when they have the holiday packaging as well. So today I'll be reacting to shoes and some ready to wear pieces. So let's just get started. First off, I want to talk about these sling bags. So we have this black sling bag and it's kind of hard to tell what kind of design this is. I think it might be a bird or some kind of floral foresty uh, tree print but it comes in that black one we also have like a white gold one there's also this white black one and if you guys already saw the first part one you guys will see a lot of these shoes actually match the handbags if you love matching stuff and for sling bags I kind of feel like they're very beautiful and very very popular but they actually hurt my feet a lot I don't know if it's the way I walk or if it's the way my feet is shaped um but it just really hurts so if i were to get sling bags again i prefer to get like the uh sandal version rather than the heels there's also this white one with a floral print looks like a rose now moving on to d-way slides and i really 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 love d-way slides i have d-way slides and d-way heels and they're just so beautiful and so comfortable i love the slides so we have this pink one, and it looks like it's also another like floral print. Um, actually, there's also a rabbit in the front where your toes will be at. So there's rabbits up there. And then we have a blue one. Um, it looks like another floral tree print. Then we have a black one with some flowers. We have another black one. It looks like there is a bird and a tree. We also have, again, that same white-black design. We have a blue-white one with the like star sun logo. Then moving on to these heels. They look very, very beautiful, but they are way too high for me to wear. And I'm not too sure they're comfortable. I kind of feel like they would hurt in the front just because of the way the sandals, uh, the heels are styled. There's also these shoes. Not too sure what kind of shoes these are called, but I actually do want to try them on because they're very beautiful. I love the like heel detailing in the uh, back of the shoe. It's very, very pretty. And even the little buckle in the front to hold on to your feet even has like a little like pearl detailing in the front. I love that. There's also a black um, beige one. Now moving on to Dior Walk and Dior Sneakers. Uh, we have a blue and white one. We have another floral print, another floral print. And another floral print and now moving on to these sneakers you guys I highly highly recommend getting these ones these are super comfortable the most comfortable even better than walking Dior sneakers these are the Dior star sneakers they currently have three available they have the white with the black star which is what I have there's white with a gold star and there's a beige one now they're coming out with a black one with white star and it's just so comfortable. I actually wore these when I went hiking 
and I know you got like, Trish, why are you wearing white sneakers to hiking? I know, but those are like my only shoes I have besides Walk and Dior sneakers and D Player and Dior ID. And those are the most comfortable out of all my shoes that I have. So I had to wear those and don't worry you guys, it's still super, super clean. It's just so comfortable and they're really great shoes. They're great for traveling, honestly. So I highly recommend getting those. We also have some Dior boots. Dior ankle boots and also high knee boots as well and we had these Dior Alps um, boots they're great for uh, going onto the mountains snowy area and I, I assume Dior is going to have another Dior Alps collection which has like beanies snow gear uh, snowboards all that stuff these boots highly highly recommend getting these boots I know I'm recommending you guys a lot of things but these boots are super comfortable they came out with these boots years ago. They were called Dior Nautily D boots. And now they came back with it. It's a little bit different. But these boots are so comfortable. I can wear it all day long. Just so nice. So there's a black one uh, with heels in the back. And there's another black one with higher heels in the back. And this is the one that I am considering purchasing once it comes out. This one has floral prints, it's like lace, and it says Christian Dior. So everybody will know that I'm wearing Christian Dior boots. So I'm very, very in love with this one. It also comes with a higher boot as well. And now moving on to ready-to-wear pieces. We have a floral print a sweater. Dior always makes this kind of sweater. It is a bit more snugged on the um, body. So if you don't really like this kind, I do not recommend getting this kind of sweater. And we also have this jacket. It's actually very similar to the jacket I'm wearing today. Mine is actually short sleeve, but this one is the Macro Canage jacket. This one has it is has two rows of uh, buttons, so it's double breasted, and it also has the same collar as me as well. But it's just long sleeved and it's double breasted. Mine is only one button, and it's short sleeved. But it's super comfortable. It is very thin, but it keeps you so so warm. So I really recommend getting the Macro Canage jackets. Also this really, really cute beige blouse. I actually really am loving it. It's short sleeve and it has a little like B C D logo so everybody will know it's Christian Dior. So I'm really excited to try this on once it comes out. And we have a lot of Dior t-shirts. We have a boat one. We have a rabbit and I'm really, really digging this one. This is super, super cute. A rabbit and it also says... Uh, Jardine Ma, uh, Ma... Oh, I don't know how to pronounce that one. But it does say Jardine, which is garden. Garden... Yeah, I'm not too sure what the last word is. But let me actually search it up. Google Translate. Okay. Jardine, hopefully I'm pronouncing that right. Mag... Um. Oh, it means magic garden. Okay, I'm learning some French. Magic Garden Rabbit uh, t-shirt and I'm really really loving this one. We also have again that same blue like is it like a star or like a sun kind of logo. And then we have this t-shirt that has a big gigantic star and has like floral prints and a lot of different birds all around a t-shirt which I'm really really loving because I love the star shape. It's my favorite shape. And we have a heart t-shirt as well. And then we also had that same blue one again with the star um, logo. And then there's also this jacket. If you guys saw the Dior Cruise 2023 runway show, you would see they wore a lot of this kind of like cardigan jacket in the runway, like white and black. And the next one is a Dior sweater. This one I think is reversible because I have a similar one. And because of the way it looks on the picture, it looks like it's reversible. One side is going to be heart, and then when you flip it over, inside is going to be like burgundy red, and I think the back is going to say Christian Dior, and maybe it's striped. I'm not too sure because I don't know how the inside looks, but that's how the oblique is. One side's oblique, the other side is navy blue, and in the back it says Christian Dior. And then there's also this gorgeous black white dress. I do want to try this on. I love Dior dresses. And my birthday is going to be in January, so I need to get a dress in November or December for my birthday to wear to Dior. There's also this gorgeous white red one, really, really digging the pop of red. And there's this gorgeous like beige pink uh, dress floral print as well. There's also this off-shoulder shirt from Dior. I do love off-shoulder shirts, but the thing with this is that how will anybody know it's Dior? Yes, you will know it's Dior, however... 
it honestly could be like any brand like it could be from Macy's it could be from Nordstrom so it's kind of like do you I do I really want to get it like I love off shoulder but the thing is like it, it nobody will know it's Dior because it's just a pink one there's also a purple one like I said it's very pretty I'm sure it's super comfortable but it's really hard to tell what anybody know it's Dior so yeah, that is the Dior Cruise 2023 collection ready to wear and shoes. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and follow me on Instagram. Take a look at my uh, TikTok, like to know it, and Patreon. And I will see you guys next time. Bye!